If you're looking for the cheapest and most reliable Madden 22 coins on the market, check out my sponsor, MMOEXPR.com. Links are in the description, and use code JEDI at checkout for 5% off. Alrighty, hey there guys, Adrian Acosta here, aka Jedi Bro 95 coming at you guys with another video. So, we have our last, uh, we have our second limited for the uh, limiteds for the week, and then we also have the final part to the playoff promo. Uh, everything was revealed, there was no special, like, uh, cards that they revealed tonight, or like, whatever, so... You know, I could have theoretically made this video at like 9 o'clock this morning and quite honestly it would have been fine. But you know what? I wanted to wait in a little while because I was busy with other things today. But, you know, uh, so for the other LTD, for the it is Mike Gusecki for the, for the uh, Miami Dolphins. 93 speed, 98 catching. Pardon me. He does get 99 ca uh, spec catch, which I think he now is the first 99 spec catch in Madden 22. So, you know, he's, you know, he's actually pretty good. Also, I think Mike Gusecki is like six foot one six foot two so not a bad size you know very solid tight end for a dolphins theme teamer uh so now let's go into the um go into the uh playoff promo uh so they actually just showcased the 94s and then they also showcased the uh big uh like the the champions they didn't showcase any of the little cards which i don't think there is going to be any uh any of those which you know i don't blame them but gabriel davis i think this should have been a 96 i think he how he played he was incredible. This guy had four touchdowns. Uh, he was He's the only receiver now in history with four touchdowns. But, you know, 94 speed, 90, 89, 89, 95 for the route running. He has great catching. I really think this should be in the 90s for the route running uh, because of how he burnt that defensive back so bad and made him fall on his ass. Uh, but Gabriel Davis looks really, really good. Uh, really no issues for me for Bills fans. And then you got Amani Hooker for the um, Tennessee Titans. 94 speed, 95 zone. You know, he's he's okay. He's a great coverage safety, but not really much in the run game. You know, he has, like, a 90 pursuit. I'm going to assume he probably has, like, 83 block shed or something like that. Uh, but, you know, he's all right. Then you have playoff Lenny. He got a card. 94 speed, 96 acceleration, 95 truckle, trucking and break tackling. Uh, so, yeah, playoff Lenny got in a card. He actually was pretty good against the uh, Rams. Uh, they had almost that crazy-ass comeback against, the, against them, but... Uh, unfortunately, the Rams were able to eke out a last-minute vict, a last-second, quite literally, last-seconds victory against them, and yeah, it was it was an incredible game. This past weekend was actually pretty good for the playoffs. I don't know how this weekend is going to be, but you know, I won't be able to watch any of those games because unfortunately, I have to work on the weekend, which sucks. So it is what it is with that. But uh, then you have uh, Rashad Gray for the Packers. Uh, 90 speed, 95 finesse move, 95 power move, 95 block shed. You know, he's, yeah, he's all right, you know. But, you know, the Packers already have a lot of outside linebackers as it is, so they really don't need another one. But, you know, he is looking fine. You know, he's a fine card. Uh, then for the Masters, so the first card we have is Nicole Hardman. 97, 96 speed, 94, 90, 93, 94, 97 for the route running. Uh, now, he does get deep out elite for 1AP because he is a deep threat. A wide receiver uh which honestly i actually do think this card is pretty good uh now i know some kansas city chiefs fans want patrick mahomes uh which to be completely honest i can understand why they would want a patrick mahomes but keep in mind he could very well the the chiefs could very well make the super bowl it, honestly they're they're my picks to make the super bowl and winning actually i think they're gonna win the super bowl this year so uh he could get super bowl mvp which would be honestly that would be um Something that theoretically could happen. So, Chiefs fans, you don't need to worry about him not getting an upgrade right now. Because, who knows? Maybe he might get an upgrade for the NFC Championship uh, one. Maybe he might get a Super Bowl pass card. We don't know yet. But I do know that, you know, he should be getting an upgrade soon, probably. Uh, and then the last one is going to be Nick Scott for the Rams. 95 speed, 95 man, 96 zone, 93 zone. You know, he actually played very good. If I remember correctly, he was a... Um, practice squad player before they had to call him up with some injury with an injury to jordan fuller uh so they called him up and now he is a um he won ended up getting uh he had i think he got a pick against uh uh against uh against the uh bucks i think if i remember correctly he got a pick uh against brady i don't necessarily remember off the top of my head but you know it is what it is but you know the bucks are the, the rams did get another card quite frankly in my opinion they did deserve it uh, and then the last card I want to show, there's a couple more actually. So the first one is going to be, uh, Jordan Willis for the Niners. Uh, so 88 speed, 94 acceleration, uh, 90 
six strength, 97 block shed power move, and 88 finesse move. You know, he's a good solid power rusher. I would actually be more, I actually would play this guy on the edge because he does have some solid finesse move. Uh, but, you know, he's a very good pass rusher. You know, 90 speed on a Niners team team. I don't necessarily remember if he has any other team chems, but he does get a good amount of, uh, good amount of, uh, he has a good amount of st uh, stats, is what I'm trying to say. And then the last one they showcased was uh, Evan McPherson. Now, this card is very special uh, for a couple of the reasons they did talk about today. Uh, so, with this ability, you can get uh, 96 kick power. You get 96 kick power and 93 kick accuracy. But the one thing that they said about this card, that RG said about this card, is the with Evan McPherson, he comes with Focus Kicker, which is the ability he gets stock. He gets it for 1 AP. Which then means for the 2 AP, you can get both Focused and Clutch Kicker on Evan McPherson. So that is actually a big dub in my personal opinion. I actually do think that is a huge W. And I hope that they do uh, up the AP for special teams soon. But I don't necessarily think they're going to. So, But I'm I'm definitely going to pick this, try and pick this card up. You know, because I do like, I would like to have a Focus Kicker as well as a um, Clutch Kicker. Uh, because, you know, as good as Nick Folk is, and I really do like Nick Folk, at the end of the day, you know, I would like to have both kicker abilities just because it's, it's a kicker. And honestly, I think I wouldn't even need to change it until Sebastian Janikowski comes out, if he does come out, or they put out like a 99 overall gold kicker. So it is what it is with that. And then the LTD today for tomorrow is going to be Stefan Diggs, 95 speed, 96, 97, 98 for the route running, uh, 95 catching, 99 spec catch. So he is the first wide receiver to get 99 spec catch. Uh, this is for the Minneapolis Miracle, which, uh, sorry, Saints fans, it is uh, pretty a, a bit of pretty big bummer. Uh, but this card has to be on a theme team to be good. Otherwise, Stefan Diggs is just not the best card in the world. I'm going to be straight up honest. I really do think Stefan Diggs needs to have a speed increase. I think he should be 96 speed base uh, and then power up to 97 speed. Uh, but that's neither here nor there. But Stefan Diggs looks pretty good. Uh, overall, you know, Bills and Vikings team team do for, definitely did get a big upgrade. Uh, and then for the, um, and then for the last card today, it's going to be Jordan Whitehead. This was the card that everyone can get for their team. That's already in the game right now. So you can get, uh, Jordan Whitehead's power up right now. And you can actually power him up until you hit the 93 overall. And then you have to wait for this card unless you have the power up pass, but I would wait till tomorrow to get the power up pass but here's the jordan whitehead stats 93 speed 95 excel 90 tackling uh 92 zone coverage 96 hit power he does come with uh acrobat enforcer and deep in zone ko uh for stock abilities but you can put him in the power up and you can get uh those abilities uh again for um obviously cheaper or you know you can get the power up stats which honestly on the on a the theme team 98 speed on a the theme team isn't the worst i actually do think he's pretty nice now, I think the cost for the abilities is going to be about 4 or 5 AP, if we're being honest. Because I think, if I remember correctly, Acrobat's 2 AP for... And it's Acrobat's 2 AP, and then Enforcer's 2 AP, and then Deep End Zone KO is also 2 AP. But I think EA probably will put it for 4 AP, just because uh, it is cheaper. You know, it'll be... That's how much the abilities are, if they discount them. You get what I'm trying to say. I think that's what they're going to do. So... Pardon me. But I do think... You know, he is actually pretty good. You could if you get 325 out of 50 uh theme team for your for your team, you know, you can get an extra plus three to your speed, uh, which would ultimately give you uh 99 speed Jordan Whitehead. So there is that. Uh and then lastly, guys, I think that I think that's actually it for the uh playoff content coming tomorrow. So uh with that being said, guys, yes, it is. Uh that being said, there actually was a huge leak that they that uh Mutt leaks put out today. Now, this I would recommend nobody do. Never do this, guys. They basically have figured out that you can find a way to sell off your NAT and NCAT uh, items, including strategy items, power up pass, tokens, season players, team captains, yada, yada, yada. You can actually sell them on the market for coins, but the person who gets them in return um, is going to get... Um, is going to get an NCAT version, so they cannot buy it off the market and then try and resell it. Which, honest to, honestly, like, it's already beginning. Like, there's already people that are doing it, as you see right here. Uh, someone already put up an NCAT Darren Waller for 240,000 coins. Now, personally, I think this is bullshit that this is something that needs to be done. And I hope EA does get around to doing something about this. Um, 
I think this is absolutely horseshit. I like there's no other nothing else for me to say other than the fact that this is horseshit. Uh, EA, please do something about it. Uh, but with that being said, guys, that is going to do it for the uh, video. Uh, if you guys did enjoy the video, hit the like button below and subscribe if you guys are new to the channel. Also, just one last reminder, make sure that your EA account, be it on PlayStation or Xbox, is linked to your Twitch account because tomorrow you will be able to start earning drops to where you can make to so that way you could start earning uh, tokens for the um, uh, for the uh, what the heck is this? What's it, what is it called? Uh, for the uh, Darwin James, and just a reminder what the Darwin James looks like. Let me go find it here. Let me just showcase to you guys a reminder what the Darwin James uh, card looks like that you can earn. Uh, you got your veterans, uh, Darwin. Here he is, right here. So, just a reminder this is what the Darwin James looks like for the Madden Bowl. You exchange three tokens, you can get this free Darwin. Uh, powered up, he gets 99 speed on every team. You don't necessarily need to have the um, the card in question. You can uh, you don't have to have a theme team, or you just have the the strat item boost, and you can have a 99 speed safety. Uh, he also does come with acrobat, kick artist, and mid zone KO for free. Uh, it will cost about three four AP if I'm correct. But just reminder, make sure your account is linked so that way you, everybody can get a, basically a free 99 overall safety, a 99 speed safety. But that's going to be it, guys. Hope you guys did enjoy. Hit the like button if you guys did, and subscribe if you guys are new. And I'll see you guys in the next video. I'm out. Peace.